Today marks a painful anniversary. It's been a year since Cassandra Cake was found dead in a house east of downtown Windsor. She was seven months pregnant. Now her loved ones are pushing for a law to protect what they're calling unborn children, but they're facing challenges. Sean Malley joins me live from where it happened a year ago. Sean, tell us about Molly Matters. Well, Lisa, firefighters responded to a fire here a year ago. They found Cassandra Cake dead. Police later determined that she had been beaten and the blaze set on purpose. The movement called Molly Matters is named after the fetus that Cassandra Cake was carrying. Today, the father of that unborn baby visited the officials of uh, visited the offices of local MPs, accompanied by Cake's mother. They were delivering a petition. They want the law to change so it's a criminal offense to harm a fetus when the mother is harmed. It's been tried before with Bill C-484, but that didn't get very far in the House of Commons and was dropped seven years ago. Now the bill's supporters have amassed 15,000 signatures online and on paper. Though it raises questions it's, about limiting abortion rights, like Cake's that. loved ones and, say uh, that's not the real issue for them. It's an obvious injustice. And, you know, I think the more that people educate themselves and see that this is not some sort of pro-life initiative or political initiative, they'll be able to see that the injustice of, of what is happening here. Now, Sean, a lot of people on our Facebook page were supporting this petition. Uh, what did the MPs have to say about it? Well, Windsor West MP Brian Massey uh, says he uh, looks forward to receiving the petition. Uh, he actually studied the bill when it first came out, and though he says he has a lot of sympathy for Cake and her family, he says this bill is simply doomed to fail. No, I can't uh, agree to resurrect that uh, bill because uh, it was clear um, that the bill was not going to be able to pass uh, through the parliamentary system and had significant legal issues and challenges with it that um, unfortunately don't make the bill um, something that's viable. Now Durham says he's repeatedly tried to meet with Brian Massey, but Brian Massey says that uh, because he's in Ottawa that makes it excessively difficult, but he leaves the door open for a future meeting with Durham. Lisa? Thanks so much for that, Sean. CBC's Sean Malley reporting live from Benjamin Avenue tonight.